Hey guys, today let's play for the king. Uh, this is a strategic roguelike RPG. Um, yes, there's many of them out there, but this is, yet, uh, this is another one. But this one came out in 2018, so I can't say that it's part of the recent trend because uh, it's actually predated that. <laughs> so, anyways, um, yeah, I just heard a little bit about it. It has online co op too, which is cool. But yeah, let's check it out. Start a new game here. Um, okay, choose an adventure here uh, for the king. This is Battle Against Chaos and a story driven adventure to solve the king's murder. Okay, interesting. Frost Adventure Brave the Cold and Search for Lost Treasure. Into the Deep. Explore the Deep and its many hidden secrets. Dungeon Crawl. Oh, yeah, that's a lot of cool, uh, I guess, different campaigns here. Mm hmm. Okay, Gold Rush and Lost Civilization. Okay, so uh, I guess you go, I should go with the one. Uh, Actually, can, I can select different difficulties for all these. Uh, let's go with Lost Civilized. Actually, this is like more like Uncharted, right? <laughs> Interesting. Uh, I'll go with Journeyman. Actually, wait, Adventure is here. Okay, never mind. I'll go with this one because I haven't played this game before. Oh, wait, are this, is this DLC? Okay, this one's DLC. I can't, I can't do that one. <laughs> okay, let's see. Yeah, let's do it. This one's only on Journeyman, okay. Okay, Dungeon Crawl. Let's go with Into the Deep. Try this one. Okay, so the graphics are kind of like this um, type of uh, cell shaded or pixelated style. Uh, kind of cartoony pixelated style, I should say. Yeah, it's not, not really cell shaded, it's like cartoony pixelated. And we've seen this in some indie games before. So yeah, it's not quite as common as the 8-bit, 16-bit style, but still, uh, still like relatively common for indie games. All right, um, can I, does it have to be three players? Like can, can this one be computer? I wonder if this is gonna be computer if I don't, uh, cause I don't have another player to play with me right now. Uh, I guess I'll be blacksmith, hunter, scholar, minstrel. What scholar did? What's this? Yeah, I wonder what this uh, class is. Scholar. Hmm. Okay, let's. Uh, no, nope, that's too much. This one's fine. Okay. Um. Yeah, I guess that's. Wait, she's a scholar. I'll her be a blacksmith then. Actually, I'll be a black. Wait, what's minstrel? Okay. Um. Wait. No, I'm gonna have her be a minstrel. Okay. Now I'm wondering, like, is the other, are the other guys computer controlled then? Because I don't have another player playing with me. So, and you got to have to have three players. So I wonder if the other ones are computer controlled. Fish person. Okay. So this is turn based. Uh, and it's on hexagonal tiles. So. It does remind me of some other games I played before. Um, yeah, there's a lot of the games that try to do these, uh, yeah, tile based, but usually they're also card based um, as well. But this was not card based, I don't think. But yeah, this is uh, definitely I've seen like yeah some tactical, uh, tactical RPGs as strategy games like this too. Okay, uh, ambush, sneak, retreat, ambush, fail, oh success. Okay. Okay, so this is the combat system interface. We it's a turn-based combat, and uh, let's see what can we do here. Surge air area blast. Hmm. Beastmen were shot, and then uh, the minstrel. Is that area blast? Oh, look at that! It turned into a pile of bones. What does a minstrel do again? I don't think she ever went. Okay, let's go here. Can we go here? Hmm. Services in. Stay at the inn or meditate. Heal or bless. Market. 
Okay, so I don't have enough money to buy anything. I only have five gold. That's not enough to buy anything right now. Quest for bounty. Okay, I'll we'll accept that and uh, kill the bandit. Sure, easy enough. Engage and come. Okay, can we attack him? Or not? It doesn't seem to let me attack. Yeah, I can't seem to attack him for some reason. Why can I not do that? Engage in combat with multiple enemies. Okay. Uh, wait. Do I have to end my turn or something like that? Oh, here we go. End turn. Oh, yeah, that's, that's why. Uh, player 2's turn. Okay, am I also controlling player two? Okay, Let's see, uh, so I, I guess I'm controlling all three players then, I guess? Or what? the minstrel do? I don't think the minstrel's done anything. I don't think I can... I've never done any actions with her. <laughs> oh, here's the minstrel. Okay, I finally get to do something. Um, I can use some buff spell. <clears throat> okay, so you know, she doesn't do much. I won't choose minstrel next time. She doesn't do much. Nice. All right, got the, the hat and got more loot, nice. Okay, <clears throat> um, we got some good loot there. Let's see if we can equip that. Where's my equipment? Here. Where's the stuff I picked up? Oh, this player, right, we're, we're player two, let's go player two, okay. Wooden buckler, equip, equip, equip. Oh, I think I'll have to get the iron port hot, okay, there. Equip that. Hunting bow, um, huh. It's interesting because the other guys that show up, are they, okay, they're all part of, so I'm kind of confused because each player takes their own turns and yet every time I, I partake in a battle the other players also join me. That's interesting. Okay, so anyways, I guess I'm out of movement, so I end my turn. It's this one. Well, I guess we share gold too, because now I have 10 gold. So I guess we share gold. I, I don't get what's the point of having the three players though. Like. I'm controlling three players, and yet all of them share gold and... Well, they don't share inventory, but they do share gold. Yeah, I don't really understand that. And yet, they also join in combat. So why not... <laughs> why have them be separate? I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Yeah. I don't quite understand why uh, I have to have um, three separate players, and yet they share a lot of things. Ambush. I always choose to ambush. If I fail, what happens? We still gotta fight them anyways, right? Is there any downside? Oh, they attack first. But then... Wouldn't they attack first if I didn't fail? I don't get it. And now I'm only one guy? What happened to my other guys? So I'm, I'm only one guy. I don't know what happened to these other guys. They, they joined me before, but they don't join me now. I don't get it. Yeah, where's my other guys? They didn't join me in combat. Yeah, my other guys didn't join me in combat. Very odd. 
Oh, well, can engage actually. Drinking contest. Poison. We got poison. What the heck? Sure. We spawn here. Oh, it's just me again. just come out of me when I die. Every turn I roll movement. Oh, come on. Everything's like so much RNG here. This rest. Can I also rest here? rest once because it uses up one of the oh my god okay I can only rest once and it uses up the the item <laughs> hold on I won't use that because I already used it I'll just fight okay now I have all three of my members See if we can take care of you this time. Timber wolf beast. This time I'll have all three. come out. Oh shit. Okay, for that. Oh, take that, the bones come out. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, maybe. mumbling. Okay, that's weird. So nothing happened. Um, let me go here. Rest. There we go. Cover some health.
let's go in here. Fight. You hear a small tavern voice. <laughs> well, we, we immediately have to fight at the tavern. I see. I only got two guys right now. I don't know what determines whether the third... Uh, I don't know what, I, what actually determines whether we fight together or not, but... Yeah, sometimes I only have one guy, sometimes I got two, sometimes I got all three. <laughs> okay, um... Yep. I only got the minstrel. Okay, so I don't have the hunter guy, which is unfortunate. He does... He would have been helpful. Damn. That's a lot of damage. Shit. Tipsy pirate. So many tipsy pirates. Oh god. I'm dead. Spend a life to instantly revive. Yeah, I'll revive. Oh man, they're tough. He got a, he's got a bar stool? Shit, he's got a bar stool, watch out. Oh shit. Took us both out. Oh. oh man, that one shot took us both out. No. Forest Nibbler. Oh, how tough are they? Physical damage, six. Just a dull spear. Wooden buckler. Uh, okay, scholar wraps. Let's equip that. Got a lot of equipment now. Okay, maybe I should wait until my. until the other two regenerate, or are they not gonna regenerate? Oh, are they not gonna regenerate? Looks like they're not going to regenerate. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, okay. Looks like they're not going to regenerate. Okay. That's just one versus three right now. Shit. Hmm. That's going to be tough. Locked. Ooh, take that. Interrupted. Dodged. Wow, I'm, I'm doing good. It's one versus three and I'm doing good right now. <laughs> wow, okay. See that? Wow. Oh shit. Oh shit. Nope, can't dodge those ones. 
And I'm trying my best, but I don't think I can beat this one versus three. I'm dead next turn, I think. So I took one guy out. Hmm, nice. Oh wow, dodged both. Wow, that was that was lucky. Reloading. Oh yeah, took him down. I'm dead though, I'm only got five health. No. Shit. That sucks. Okay, anyways, um yeah, that's for the king. Um Wait, was that a... And I was into the deep? Huh. That, I wasn't aware because we weren't in the seas at all. So what if I do dungeon crawl? I'm just uh, wondering how that works. So this time I'm not going to go with the minstrel. So I'm going to go with blacksmith. That's my main character here. I mean, is it different? This one's a dungeon crawl. Prime Parable of Original Dungeons. I wonder how that works. Hmm. I think it's pretty much the same gameplay, right? Pretty much the same gameplay, yeah. Beast Man Warlock. Alright, I can do a Shockwave Slasher. Oh! Select. Okay, so, uh, purge all realm dungeons, so that's the. Oh, what the heck? This guy just appeared. I only have two guys. See, I don't get it. What happened to my third guy? What, what determines whether or not I have my party members in combat or not? That's why I don't, I don't understand. <laughs> what determines if I have them all or not? <laughs> oh, we got a, a weapon or something. Bone club. Life belt. Oh, yeah, I've done that one. 30 gold. 30 gold. Exploration 1 life. Well, it's all the way over there. I think I had to I had to all go there with all my party members. I think. Yeah. Paired it with okay. So let me put all my guys there then. Just wanna see how this dungeon thing works. Oh my god. Treat okay, I have to get past this guy. Yeah, one hit kill, baby. Critical. I'm strong. I should have chose a uh, blacksmith before. <laughs> that was a strong class, not the stupid minstrel. Oh, I ready equipped. Nice. Um, I'm just doing because I'm gonna wait until my third guy gets here. 
Yep, I'm gonna wait until my third guy gets here. Alright, now we can enter. All three. Let's do all three dungeon. Into the dungeons. Okay, so this is what's different about this scenario, is that we all to the dungeon here. What the heck, I lost health just trying to enter it. There we go. Jawbreaker. Oh. Make any final preparations. Okay, so yeah, now, now it plays like a dungeon crawler. Oh, let's see, 6, 11, okay. Uh, equip. Can I use this camp? No, nope, maybe not. Oh, I can't use any items, huh? I want to regenerate some health, but I guess I can't. Treasure chest? Open. Oh, of course it's a mimic. Yep. Yep, mimic. Alright. 28 health. Wow, this is this mimic had 30 health. Resisted. Tinder couch, what the heck?
right, guys, that's for the king. Um, yep, it's a turn-based uh, strategy RPG, and uh, it's done on a hex board, so almost like a board game, right? There's a lot of, uh, seems to be a lot of roles involved in this one, so a lot of RNG. So um, I think in that sense, you need to be kind of lucky to get far in this game. So it's not really like my favorite type of thing to do because yeah, I don't like so much RNG in a video game. But hey, I guess if you guys like board games, then this one could be, uh, up, yeah, could be kind of like that. So anyways, not bad. Um, it's a roguelike, of course, just like a lot of games are these days. Uh, just the nature of being like uh, this type of game where there's so much RNG involved, of course, it's going to be a roguelike as well. But yeah, uh, for the king, it's not too bad. Um, I wouldn't play it all the time, but definitely for like a short, uh, short run, I think it's cool. That's it. Thanks for watching. Uh, yeah, if you like board games and the RNG involved, then you might like this one.